vegetative cell structure and thallus organization of the algae. Algae shows a wide range of organization. They may be the unicellular or may be the multicellular. The algal thalli are grouped into following organization such as unicellular, colonial form, filamentous form. Unicellular algae are mostly composed of single cells. They may be the motile in the form of chlamydomonas or they may be the non-motile such as in pinularia or diatoms. Colonial form are multicellular organization in which cells are embedded in a mucilaginous matrix. Colonies may be of different sizes and shapes and the colonies that having fixed number of cells are known as synobia or singular is called as the synobium. If a, if a colony has 128 cells, the daughter colony is inside it must have the 128 cells. It is the condition for the synobium. As for us, filamentous forms are concerned. If the cells are arranged in the chains, they are called as filaments. The filaments may be the branched or unbranched. And the condition in which filaments are bright and bright in such a way that some of the filaments are present horizontally and some are present vertically. They are, the condition is called as heterostrichous condition in which some filaments may be the horizontal and the horizontal system is called as the prostrate while the vertical system is called as erect system and this condition in which both systems prostate and vertical are present is called as heterotrichus. The algal filaments may be the pseudoparenchymatous. Pseudoparenchyma is the condition in which the filaments are loosely grouped to form a pseudoparenchymatous body and the filaments may be the sinocytic. Sinocytic is the multinucleate condition in which the adjacent cells are without cell walls. So these are the main talus organization of the algae.